Hello everyone and welcome back to Into the Breach. Last time we did Island 2 here with our all science mech squad. This time we're gonna be gonna be doing Island 3. Alright, so just to review what we got here. We have Kazak in the gravity mech. He's carrying the Vec Hormones passive that we just upgraded, so now enemies do a total of two extra damage to each other. Uh, we have just a generic uh, pilot here in the swap mech. We, we just bought stabilizers for which I'm hoping is going to keep all of our mechs alive. And then finally we have Morgan in the exchange mech with missile barrage and just some extra movement. I think missile barrage really only comes in handy when there's like spiderlings. But, you know, speaking of spiderlings, we just... Th this island has them, so this might, this might actually be a good time to go do it. But the spiderlings only have one health after all. Mm, yeah, let's go do it. We'll do Detritus next. Okay, hopefully we can finally get a perfect island on this on this one. Because I really just need new pilots that have actually good abilities. Oh, look at this. Destroy two Vec egg sacs. That, that's actually perfect. With what we just got. I think we should definitely do that one. Well, we have lots of like acid puddles too that the uh, swap mech can use to kill things. Okay, let's put you more towards the middle. Yeah, that should be fine. I'm worried about the tumble bugs though. That is my greatest fear. Hmm. All right, well using missile barrage here. It would at, at, see if I did this, this would get rid of the spiderling problem like early on. I really am glad, by the way, that this doesn't target the the boulders. I'm super stoked about that. I feel like this might be just a good time to do this. Yeah. Yeah, we'll do it. That gets Morgan a, a fair bit of experience. All right, we got three threats here, and luckily. Definitely deal with that. I think we just exchange. Oh no, I can't exchange. That's right. I already I used the missile barrage. Hmm. I don't think there's any two for one specials here. I might just have to eat one grid one grid powers worth of damage. Let's see, can I make can I make the enemies kill themselves in some way? Mm, maybe not. No, I don't think there is a way. So, I think we should just let... Or, let's see, if I punch this guy, he'll, he'll die to this guy's explosion. Can I get two kills some other way? Because I could just punch this guy. Yeah, we'll do this instead. We'll swap this one. Morgan's going to take damage, but who cares? I think... Yeah, I think I'm happy with that. I mean, we're getting power back this mission anyway. Ooh, that guy just popped up out of the acid! I haven't seen that for, like, ever. <laughs> In fact, I don't even know if I, if I show that off on, um, you know, this playthrough on my YouTube channel. Yeah, guys can just randomly just pop up out of the acid on this island. Could just like swap three. Can I can I target boulders with this? Oh, I can. Yeah, I could swap the boulder with a uh, three. 
And this guy does... Oh, wait. Hmm. Yeah, I can make two kill three. And then I still need to deal with this little thingy. See, I, mean, I still have my reset. It's really hard for me to visualize this, so I'm, let me just do this. So, table kill three. I still need to deal with this thing. I could just kind of want to just go up here and just punch this guy back in. Okay, how do I deal with this thing? Be helpful to get rid of this plasmodia. Yeah, I think getting rid of the plasmodia is probably more important, more important than uh, I guess getting rid of, of a random firefly. Well, no, I need to get rid of this thing. That's the problem. This thing does three damage? Well, Kazak can take that. But I don't want to be pushed to the edge of the map. Yeah, I think it's worth it. And then we just need to swap this thing here. Or, no way, I can... No way, I can't swap it there. Yeah, we'll just do this. Yeah, it's pushing me back to like the edge of the map, which I don't particularly care for. Yeah, we're good. We have to stabilize it so we won't die to the blocking there. Who knows, maybe this Plasmodia will step in front of an acid pool or something. And take care of it that way. So many boulders, man. Alright, two moves before three, he does three damage. So if I just push this guy back... One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, if I just move my swap mech out of the way, I could just push two down and then two will... Actually, no, wait. Yeah, two has only two health left, so that wouldn't work. I could swap him into the spot. And then Kazak could... Here, let's, yeah, let's do this. Two will kill three. You just pull this guy up, I guess. You just like swap this guy with like a random boulder. Do that. Uh, yeah, that's fine. Okay, I just I hate scuttlebug so much. There's a lot of enemies in this game I hate. don't like the constant boulder creation. Well, this is the last turn, isn't it? So I don't have to be too afraid. Okay, threats here. I mean, yes, I guess uh, two, seven, five, four, and six. That's a lot of enemies, actually. Uh. I don't think Kazak can do like anything useful. I mean, I can get rid of this thing, or I can pull. It. pull actually, I can't. I can. Oh, I can stand here and just pull this guy back. Oh, I could swap one and six, and then. 
Six will kill the little spore thing. And that just leaves five and four. I don't think the swap mech can work with that, yeah. Nuts. I wish I still had Missile Barrage. I need to get another use of Missile Barrage. Hang on, let me just count up the guys. It's, it's, it's really hard for me to look at this. So yeah, four, four, five, well, let me just go in order. One's not doing anything. It's just a plasmodia. So, two, four, five, six, and seven. Wait, let me just recap. I lost count there. Two, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, there's, there's five threats. How do I deal with five threats? When only one of my mechs are kind of dealt or built to deal with double plays. Hmm. The answer is I have to get an enemy kill here. Or get, yeah, get like a friendly fire kill. Let's see, is, can two be used to kill someone? Two could be used to make six kill one, but that's kind of useless. Let's see, can four be used to kill someone? Can be used to kill anyone? Not really. I think I just gotta take a grid power here. All right, I think we just let number We just let this little spore thing do his thing. Okay, let's uh, pull this guy up. Let's see, this guy's aiming one, two, three, four tiles ahead. This guy's only aiming two tiles ahead. I think I just gotta do this. This is the last turn. Wait, what? Oh, shoot. I didn't even think about how they might be aiming. Oh, that is such a waste. Okay, good thing I have my reset. I think there's a better combination here of things I could could have done. I'm just trying to think, what can the gravity mech really do? The gravity mech can do like only this pull guy here. So let's do this. This is like a guaranteed move. Oh, you know what I didn't even consider is like, what if I swapped the boulder with something? That might have helped if I was thinking about that. Wait, if I swap this guy with this guy, yeah, let's do that instead. He's hitting me, but I can live with that. And then the swap mech just has to, let's just put this guy somewhere. Can do that. Uh, it's not the best, but it'll do. It'll do. Uh, I mean, you, we're getting more power right after this, which is a saving grace. I should have just dealt with that plasmodia earlier. Should prioritize killing it. Because it definitely is a problem having to deal with an extra enemy every turn. 
All right, kill. Oh, kill these seven enemies. I don't like. I don't like killing at least seven enemies. I mean, there are conveyor belts on this level, and there's quite a lot of water. But can I do that better than knock mites off the mech? Or knock m knock mites off the mech? Maybe I, I think I'm I think I'm probably safer off doing this one. Of course, we got a scuttlebug. Okay, well, cool. That guy put his little spore in a spot where it's gonna get um, dunked into the acid. In fact, I don't think I have to worry about anything at all. I don't think anything is gonna hit anything this turn. Just how do I secure the kills? Is it worth just using Missile Barrage right now? Could go block. I, pro I probably would say so. Just pull this guy down, then he'll kill that scuttlebug for me, which I definitely want to get rid of. Uh, can I reach this? Oh, I can! I can dunk this Plasmodia! That's kind of- that's gonna be huge. I tell you what. Did standing there not get rid of the mice for me? What the heck? Is it because I didn't take damage? That's, that's a little bit. That's a bit silly. Oh, you know what? I just realized there's a stupid mountain tile I have to worry about get getting now. How did? Uh, how did I not see that until now? Oh, there's too many things I have to do. I, I almost want to just like let that guy do his thing. Well, this guy's just gonna kill himself. I just, I might just stay here. Zok is like the only one that can like go break over that mountain, but the problem is that he's kind of like stuck. I'm like tempted just to like teleport him over here. I'm oh, sorry, not that's the wrong mech. Yeah, we'll well, I think that's worth it. We're not doing anything else right now. Do I want to save this building, or do I want to just get the mites off myself right now? I may want to save the building. I'd rather get the scuttlebug killed, actually. Hmm. Yeah, maybe just swap these two. It doesn't really matter. Uh, yeah, I'm really nervous about having to do all of this. I, because apparently, when you have the stabilizers, it doesn't get rid of the mice. So I think I just got got to throw my guys in front of some damage, or just take a turn to repair. If they don't go after buildings. It doesn't look like that's gonna happen this turn. Uh, 
Uh, I could stay here, take the damage from this guy. Might just let that building in the top, the, the left side go. Could pull this guy from here. Hang on, let me make sure there's nothing else we could do. The problem is my other guys are just too weak to like take this damage. I almost want to just... Um... Hmm, actually I don't know what I can do. The only thing that's like weak enough to damage me is like this this mosquito but if I swapped him like anywhere if I swapped him like this right I would be pushed down the conveyor belt right I think I'm gonna let this top Oh, this, sorry, this left side building go, because two guys are trying to attack it at the same time. I think what I have to do is deal with these two guys by swapping them. Okay, now they're not attacking anything. And then the swap mech can take this turn to get rid of its mites. And then Kazak. I think I'm just going to have him stand here. And why not? I'll just pull this guy. Even though this building's gonna get hit. Yeah, because Ox's blocking and he's gonna take get his mites off. Oh wait, no, the mosquito's blocking the hit. I didn't even think about that. Okay, never mind, I'm a genius. That works out perfectly. Also that number just said 10, I'm pretty sure. That was a lot of damage just now. The thing is, I can't really use the exchange mech this turn unless I blow him up on like a boulder or if I use the mosquito to attack him. Let's see, who is like an actual threat? There's one, two... On oh, the problem is I still have to collect the little dot thing! Ugh. I think I have to pick that up with him. Or, no, the swap mech could go pick it up too. Yeah, the swap mech could go get it, or I could use Kazak. See, I think this building's pretty much done as well. Although, yeah, I think I have to kill this guy. Swap mech picks up the dot, and then I still have three buildings getting hit. Is there anything two for one-y that the swap mech could do? How far can he reach? He can do that far. Well, if he swapped with the Firefly from this far away, or he would be pushed down below three, but yeah, three goes first, so it doesn't help me. Don't know. I think I just have to take like three grid damage right here. At least I'll be getting two back from this mission. Well, see, coming down here to get this dot is a bit of a waste. Yeah, let's just kill this guy. I don't know. I can't even kill this guy. What am I talking about? Don't do enough damage. Let's swap this mosquito. Get some more experience going, and then I have to repair here. Sorry, not three grid damage, it's just two, right? Yeah, it's just two. It 
Doesn't matter that the boulder is blocking that. That's an explosive boulder. Dang it. <laughs> oh, come on, Morgan. You couldn't have, couldn't have gotten that experience. Wait! Oh, I forgot about the thingy. Ugh. How did I forget about the dots? Ugh. Dang it, that was my chance to get a pilot. Uh, at least I didn't fail any objectives yet. Like, I could still get a perfect island. Alright, well, this guy just got technician. Um, fine, I guess. Oh, I feel so stupid. How could I just forget about the dot? I could have traded one power for, like, a pilot that's, like, worth two. Yeah, that was, to that was totally not worth it to for just forget about that. Alright, let's go get the reactor core from this. Oh my gosh, that's so many enemies. Five, six, seven enemies. At least I get a missile barrage to like help me out here. Okay, here's an actual time pod. Yay. In fact, I think combined with Morgan's missile barrage and the Hang on, does the... Does the machine's missile barrage do two damage or one? I forget. I need to see something. Oh, it only does one. Oh, and it hits the boulder too. But mine does what? Yeah, mine doesn't hit enemies. Yeah, but this isn't useful because this doesn't kill anything. At least this turn, you know. Alright, yeah, I'm probably best off not using my missile barrage this turn. Well, this guy isn't doing anything, I can kind of ignore him, but he's kind of blocking my way as well. In fact, I could just swap two with four and they'll do massive damage to each other. In fact, you know, two would actually kill four. Actually, yeah, we can do that. And then I'll sneak around here, punch this guy. Yeah, I can take that damage, and then that just leaves a swap mech. Deal with this guy, which I think we can. Yeah, we can do this. And then we gotta do a missile barrage here. Uh, yeah, actually, I will live that with one HP. Perfect. I gotta get rid of this stupid Plasmodia, though. I can't reach over there this turn. I could just swap two and six, and yeah, two would just kill six for me. And then I can just swap five. Yeah, let's just do that. Oh, here, oh, here is a, a problem, right? Is that? Kazak here only has one health. That means he can't tank any damage. I mean, wait. Unless I use a shield. This thing does three damage? Wow, what the heck? Actually, I may... I may want to rethink that move. Actually, I can't even do what I was planning on doing anyway. Let's reset that. I could have three kill six. Just 
just by using Kazak here. Just push power. And then I could swap. I don't know if that's really helpful. Um, how do I deal with number seven, that little spore thingy? I don't know if I really can. Cause who could I like swap into a like spot over there? It wouldn't really matter. I mean, I could just swap like seven and four. I could swap seven and two actually. Yeah, we. Oh yeah, let's swap seven and two. Oh wait! Oh, he's hitting that. Why didn't I think about that? That's so stupid of me. Swap these guys into place, and then Kazak can just kill this guy. And then we pretty much have to do a shield barrier, I think, this time, otherwise Kazak just dies. So unfortunately, some things are not going to die. I mean, that thing should still die because it's like instant death, I'm pretty sure. Yeah. Oh, dude, you suck. I'm gonna, ha I'm gonna have to use the, uh, the, uh, exchange mech to get rid of the threat here, but who do I swap him with? That is the question. I really hate how the Plasmonia just knew to like go hide in this little corner here. I think I just want to swap seven and five. Or sorry, just behind five here. Uh, yeah, that'll be fine. Wait, am I... Wait. Oh, I did that! I did that wrong! That was supposed to be the other way. That's fine, we can still do this. Actually, this, yeah, this works. And then, yeah, we gotta swap. Actually, I could, I could realize I, I could swap one of my own guys over there if I really wanted to. In fact, actually, no, let's just swap an enemy over there. Oh my gosh. I just realized something. Well, actually, I can. Okay, no, I can still use the shield barrier this turn. It's fine. Because if I use Missile Barrage, then that would mean the swap mech is, will die. So, yeah, we can still use the shield barrier. Kazak should still have a shield too, so he should be like extra safe. What can that? Yeah, why did you throw that out, dude? That can't even do anything. Hmm. Right, I really just want to get rid of this Plasmodia. It's causing me problems all day. In fact, why don't I let the exchange mech get the kill here? Because Morgan's like really close to leveling up. There we go. And let's do the missile barrage now. And then you can get the kill here. Alright, and we're good. Wow, everyone is at 1 HP. <laughs> uh, 
At least we finally get some reactor cores for the squad. I'm so starved for reactor cores. And please, Morgan, what did you get? Hopefully something good. Oh, just a reactor core in the pond. Massachus. I don't really need that. And yeah, and that's my only time pod for this island because I already missed the one I was supposed to get. Hmm. Two reactor cores. I'm torn between just getting extra, extra health, and also just extra like vec hormones being better. Hmm. I think honestly, just getting more health for both these guys would be a okay. Actually, no. Let's get. Let's get health for this one, and then we'll get movement for the swap mech. I think that'll be a-okay. Alright. And now, I kind of get to choose my mission here. Take less than three grid damage, defend the disposal unit. Disposal, mi uh, disposal unit mission should be fine. I almost want to... Yeah, let's just do the disposal unit mission. These are usually pretty easy. Although, why is there a mountain there? If there's a mountain there, that means I have to use the disposal unit, like, kind of three times instead of... Because normally, right, there's, like, you can use the disposal unit against a cluster of mountains twice, and then you can use it however you want for the rest of the mission. But the fact that this mountain is right here in the middle means I have to use it to basically destroy this mountain. Alright, let's just do that. I mean, this feels always a chance that I can destroy that mountain myself and not worry about it. Oh, you suck, dude. Why'd you put a spore back there? I think it makes the most sense just to use the disposal unit in the middle right now. Because these are, these are a lot of high-value threats I just want to get rid of. Let's just swap this thing with, yeah, with this right here. Alright. So yeah, that just kills the spore for me. Uh, yeah, there's really not much else to do. I think I'll just... Uh, let me just move closer to the side of the map, because there is an acid pool over there I might be able to use. Oh yeah, Kazakh still has his move. What am I talking about? Hang on. I completely forgot about Kazakh's ability. In fact, what I could do... Yeah, I could just destroy both of these. Oh, that's not. Hmm. I forgot this guy wasn't attacking. Yeah, let me just get this side. Oh wait, yeah, let me get this side. This guy back to this side of the map. I don't want him. I don't want him sneaking around over there. Wait, no, that's. Mm. I really just want to push this guy down. Wait, no, four moves before, or four moves after three. Actually, you know what I could do is I could just do, just swap two and four, or I could just do something like this. There we go. And then I could take this a step. Yeah, let me just swap this guy with a... Uh... 
Yeah, I'm just gonna put this guy over here. And that just leaves me to use the disposal unit. Like, let's use it here now. And then Kazak can just go block this. about these stupid spiders. I almost want to use the disposal unit just to get rid of the scion this turn. Oh wait, I can just oh no I can just do this. Yeah I'll we'll do this. Alright that's that objective done. Oh these guys are kind of blocking me in here. I guess I'll just pull this guy back, and then we can just exchange this guy with his own boulder. Yeah, that works. And then for the last turn, we get to use the disposal unit against the enemies. Hooray! Alright, let's use it against these two. Oh, well, there's lots of annoying smoke in the way, isn't there? Well, I guess I just gotta do is swap these two. And then, yeah, we're basically done. Feels good having everyone at max XP, so I don't have to worry about leveling them up. Let's see, I forget, was I still eligible for a perfect island? I think I was, right? At least I can get a new pilot that way. Oh, Scorpion, oh, I love the amount of acid pools on this. I'm gonna have a field day with this. I'm just gonna put the swap mech kind of in the middle so it can go to pretty much anywhere it needs to. Oh, cool boss isn't doing anything. Alright, I really just want to get rid of these dang tumble bugs. <laughs> I'll just swap this guy. Uh, is it worth it to do this? Actually, yes, it is. Let me just move more like, yeah, let's just go block this and then do it. Now what I can do is I can swap. Yeah, I can swap the boss in this tumble bug. Oh no, this is Kazakh's mech. That's right. That doesn't kill him. I totally mixed up my mechs there. I can push the boss up here. In fact, I think that's my only. Actually, no, I, I forgot I have the grab well too. Let's just pull this guy up. Kinda hate how he created a boulder next to the corporate tower, but oh well. It's just something we have to live with. I think we gotta like surgically remove this boss using the swap mech. In fact, let me. Let me 
take out this guy from here. Yeah, I think I just want to swap a boulder with this guy. Now we have a very dangerous line of boulders we have to worry about. Oh, and the problem is that there's going to be three new enemies as well. Oh, one of them is a Plasmodia! And there's a Spider Scion! Oh my gosh, dude. Why are you just adding to the pile of boulders? Unfortunately, this boss can be killed, like, fairly easily. Uh, let's do this. Unweb my own guy. Alright, so yeah, th this, this guy's gonna kill him. I think what I just do is kill the Spider Scion now. Hang on. I actually may not. Just killing a spider side might not be this the best way to go about things. Swap this thing over into that. And the Kazak can just kill this guy off. And then we'll have to deal with the spider next turn, I know. Oh well. I really should have saved my missile barrage until after I saw the Scion. Dude, are you absolutely serious right now? Okay, this is the last turn, so all that matters is just surviving. And there's so many enemies that are just attacking right this turn. I can't use this... I need to swap the Scion in there somehow. I guess I can just swap the Scion from, like, over he here. Then I can go over here and swap him in. There we go, we're all set. Now who do I want to just kill for funsies? I guess this, maybe. Man, that is just a big old pile of explosive boulders I'm, I'm hoping Detritus is just okay with. Right, eight reputation. Perfect island reward, finally. Ooh, Ghana. I don't think I've ever really used Ghana. Critical shields is kind of tempting too, although I already have my passives filled out, right? Mm -hmm. How useful is Ghana gonna be this late in the game, though? That is the oh, Ghana has skill too. Would I replace him? I would replace him with this guy, right? This guy isn't even doing it. Yeah, we'll just get Goner. It's fine. Alright, let's sell our default dude. Alright. Weapons. Don't really want any of these, I think. Oh, the shield array could be good. I would just get rid of Missile Barrage if I did that. Mm. Can 
thing. I wish I actually looked at my pilots beforehand because that guy had conservative. He would have been actually been really helpful to have this on. And Morgan is just being so useless, I will admit. Mm. I think I have to pass on the shield ray, even though I would love to have it. So I would have to sell, like, two of my weapons, or like a weapon and a pilot to get the shield array. Okay, let's just get three reactor cores. We'll put Ghana in there. Alright. Put the reactor core into Ghana's ability. Alright, now we have two more cores. How do I want to spend these? Like, getting extra damage on the Missile Barrage could be really good, because this up this essentially upgrades the damage to 3 with Morgan's uh, opener. Hurt enemy could be useful, too. I don't know, guys, I don't know! I think it's probably safer just to get the Vec Hormones upgrade. Yeah, I'm just gonna do that. I'm good with that. It kind of sucks how we missed out on that time pod um, from that one mission. But yeah, guys, that's gonna be the end of this episode. I hope you enjoyed. Next time, we'll be doing the fourth and final island here with our all-science squad. So yeah, I hope you guys have a good day, and I'll talk to you later. Bye!